I think the biggest thing that our guys did a great job of um, is moving on from a year ago. Uh, we really started out the preseason last, last, last spring really excited to move on. And so our guys did an unbelievable job of just trying to improve their individual games and most importantly getting healthy. Um, because none of, you know, mayhem, none of this stuff works unless you have 10 or 9 to 10 healthy bodies. Um, so we've done a great job of getting healthy. And I think our biggest focus uh, with the new rules has been not fouling, playing without the foul. And as always here, it's playing together, having playing with a ton of camaraderie. I think this year, you know, with our veterans coming back, we're going to be more of a team, more consistent. And I feel like that's going to be, you know, very vital down the uh, stretch of the season. We're fast. We get up and down the floor. Um, I think we got a good chance to get a lot of early shots in transition. We got, we got depth, we have a lot of players that come off the bench for us and uh, contribute in the game right away. Just thinking about that, you know, that whole moment, that whole game, it definitely hurts all of us, you know, being so close, being able to just almost, you know, coming away with the championship, it definitely hurts us and fueled us, you know, during the off season and preseason like that. So we definitely, you know, filled with a lot of fire and determination to get back there again and actually win it. Um, our camaraderie is always one of the most important things, our spirit. Um, you know, we really believe in playing together as a team. Um, each of our guys have dis different strengths and weaknesses. So we try to put together a game plan that's based solely on our strengths and allow each of our individual guys to play to those strengths. We have, you know, Julian Norfleet, who's coming back as our point guard, you know, definitely changed our system up, you know, able to put more points on it, able to lead our team with two wings now, with uh, me and Sam on the wing. Definitely going to be hard to guard, and uh, with Christian going to bring a nice, you know, strong presence in the inside. So it's definitely going to be kind of, you know, hard to guard us this year. You know, definitely after last year experiencing what we have and just learning more. So uh, the veterans definitely going to, you know, bring and bring the freshmen along with us, you know, bring them up to pace and, you know, get them on the same page. Well, I love our depth. Uh, I think we have quality depth. We have uh, several guys that can guard many different positions. I love our post guys. Uh, you talk about Taylor Danner and Christian Kreiner on the inside. Uh, they've improved their game so much from a year ago, and so I'm really excited to have two dominant post guys that we can go to. Oh, non-conference schedule is very tough this year, and but we actually have a chance to win like a few games, and we're going to definitely try to do that. Well, in conference, it's always going to be tough in NEC. Uh, you play in really, you play in really tough places, tough crowds, and there's just a great crop of coaches in the league now. And so every night you're going to need to be ready once the NEC play begins. Um, obviously, right now our focus remains on the non-conference.